did not realize that time had gone past and I was too busy reading the read me on the game we're going to play, but it is stream time and we're late just because don't worry about it. But we're going to try playing new games as we are every Monday. Um, yesterday, the extra Final Fantasy stream, uh, stream didn't finish all the stuff that I did, but I don't even know if I'm going to finish it on stream later. I mean, like the raids are an interesting thing that I think would be good to stream, but also like... I don't, the, the, the rewards you get the, from them are only like weekly, right? And I wouldn't want to like just give up the rewards for it. I don't know. Uh, we'll see if I do. Probably not. Probably not going to stream. Like, I don't know. Or maybe I'll just like stream to people on Discord if that happens. But we're trying to play Crash Lander today for a second. And when I was setting it up, I was unsure if it was gonna work, because it's 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 weird. But I think after looking at the README, it's it's much uh, more possible, I believe. So we will uh, let's just try it. Let's just get into what's like evil house music. Is this from fucking uh, Hyrule Warriors? That is a game that I would like to play as well. But again, it's like one of the, why all the games I want to play are like so fucking long, and I have so many more games. That's why I'm glad the the thing we have now because we could just get in and get out and see what the fuck is going on uh but yeah hold on let's just get to it let's get to it and get rid of the get rid of the music i don't think i even have the game up because it was odd getting it yeah let's just launch it from here because i'm already in here transition over it. Oh shit. Main menu. Okay, so we're here in Crash Lander. I wasn't trying to... I guess that illustrates the technique of the game. This is very odd, this game. Like, I currently can't hold on let's get rid of this shit i keep accidentally and then i can't get out and then i can't see where my mouse is so this game is already kind of jank okay at least i can use this instead of Okay. Tutorial. Okay, so what I am um, There we go. Wait, is it? What? Is there restart thrust? Like I couldn't see anything. Why is it like this? It's like, I know from the, the... The menu is like... Oh my god. What the hell? Let's go back to the menu. Let's see if we can go options, because I think there's something wrong with it. Play music, music volume, invert camera controls, VR render scale, tunnel vision, what the fuck is this? Monitor field of view. Maybe this is it. Let's go that. Okay, can I get out of here? Wait, oh. So maybe that's what it is. It's just I'm zoomed in for some reason. Though... Why does it do that? Okay, I have these. Well... I wish it would let me... 
Hold on. Let me look around. That would be nice. I don't even know where my mouse is. Nope, that makes it go. Space also makes it go. Nope. So far, this is in Game Sucks territory. We might have to go to the next game on the list, which was Dev Theism. Whoop. Okay. Pressing down doesn't make it go in the same way that it was before. I'm pretty sure... Okay, there's space. There's escape. There's also... Why is the camera so fucked? I just want to know what the controls are. Okay, we're kind of kind of getting close to the thing. We still can't see the keyboard thing. What are these? Nope. This does not help. I don't know what Why is the camera so bad? Pat Hover Ring Runner. Okay, what if I have the monitor field view out the whole way? I wish you could do this in the the level menu because then what is tunnel vision? I don't want to I don't know, camera cage? Like, there's no way to be like... Camera. Okay, we're still having the same issue where the camera is slowly going lower than I would need to see it, and then I can't... Okay, let's see if I can alt-tab to the fucking... What? Uh, to the read me again, which you guys can't see, which is fine. Da 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 da. Wazd forward, back, turn left and right. Not now, Adobe. Strafe left and right, restart the level, toggle the trails effects, pause menu, toggle FPS counter, decrease, increase camera's field of view. Oh, okay, so there was that, and that's the brackets. Adjust gamepad dead zone. Nine, zero? Middle mouse, backspace, recenter the Oculus view. Well, that's not. Talk to the Oculus. Okay. Um, sorry, stream. I did have. Okay, so the Discord friend is here. Hello. I did have your chat up, but now I'm just fucking trying to mess around with the thing. So it's fine. You didn't actually miss anything. I'm just trying to get this thing off the ground and it's not... Okay, so if I... Okay, so I can do that, but it doesn't really help. Okay, so I can see it enough that we can kind of try doing things. So we can... Hmm, that rotates the thing. So I guess I have to keep it... Okay. The game looks like it's very fiddly. Yeah, it's... It's pretty fiddly. If it's one thing, it is it is that. Okay, hold on. I can strafe left and right. Okay, I like that. I wonder why we can only strafe left and right and not forward and backward. What also is the point of the game? Oh, is it to get there? Oh. No, go back up. Okay, we can... Nope. Did I turn around and that's why my strafing is backwards? No, no, no. no. Oh! <sighs> I don't know if I'm... If this is the tutorial already, I don't know if I'm gonna... Nope. 
I've turned the launcher around and now I'm having Oh Fuck! I thought I had it. Oh. What the fuck? What the fuck is that? Oh, do I have to get both of them? Uh, damn it. Okay, so I did get that one. I don't know what the next one is, though. What the fuck is that over here? This points at the next pad. Oh, interesting. Uh. Pro tip, look for red lights. Okay. Oh. I wish there was more music. Is that supposed to be a real language, I wonder? Final pad. Third pad landed, final pad unlocked. Okay. Video tutorial. Wait, can I see that? I wish I could, like, turn the camera. But that's not a thing that I can do. Uh, you know what? Nope. Which way am I facing? Nope. Here we go. It's this one. I'm glad I don't have, like, fuel to worry about, because otherwise I would get pretty mad. So it's like Klopp getting over it in these pilots. Yeah. Yeah. Hi, I'm this Lilac. I'm struggling. It's all the way over there. It definitely is that genre of, like, the janky rule. Uh, the janky um, controls are the point. That's the challenge. I'm going to turn off the camera cage once we get back to the main menu. But... Uh... <sighs> Cause like I don't think it's actually helping me, and the fact that I can like rotate my I'm gonna call it the GameCube because it has a handle on it. Uh. Okay. Uh. Is this how you actually land a reel? I hope not. Watch for a bit, but I don't think I'm up for three hours of this. I don't think I'm up for three hours of this game, so I think we're actually gonna, like, end after this, because the fact that I'm getting annoyed, I think I'll just go play Dev Theism after this, which is more of a... Fuck! A regular, like, RPG. I don't think I'm playing this game. This is not... This is not my... This isn't my idea of fun. Dog. I, f I like how this last one is just like, so do you know how to control this thing? Or was that an, uh, a fucking fluke? This is this might actually be easier in VR. Actually, you know what? This is easier if... What is my... Yeah, this is easier if I... Uh, use the... I hate this actually. Come on, like just one target. One last target and then you can stop playing this game. Like I like how the tutorial is talking about something and I'm just like struggling, like I don't know. Okay, let's land it. Nope, the strafe, I think we can... Okay, okay, okay. We're so close. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, thank fuck. Best time, no shit. New star earned.
stars zero didn't i earn a star isn't that what they whatever i didn't even like fucking oh normal one of 150. yeah this does this does feel like it sucks so we're gonna play the next game on the list i can't believe <laughs> i can't believe like immediately it's just like this is bad this is i think probably uh a record i'm gonna say i don't know steam vr has been in the background being like are you gonna use me and i'm like no no so let's see dev theism is let's edit the description And then we're gonna change this. The, we'll call this the viable game roulette. Well, I'll we'll actually call this random. Itchio games, because that's what it is. It's it's less. And right now we're doing dev theism. Oh, come on, brackets. There you go. Update that. Okay, where's the next next game? Luckily, this is why I uh, install several of these because sometimes they're just like straight up duds, and we can't. Okay. Can I? Hmm. It looks like I won't be able to increase the size of this, so let's. Dev theism. There's no options. Please register the game. Please show the game so that I can show it to the people. No? Specified window is not a game. Says you! Okay, whatever. We'll use window capture. Uh, the There we go. And it is... Full thing, we have the color source up. So let's transition over. We can hear it, we can hear me. Let's get Discord back up. It's pretty fast bonus bad. Did you say the Bible game? Oh, Viable. Viable. <laughs> I thought it might be Bible, but it did sound like Bible. I mean, maybe, yeah, yeah, like it's, it is not the worst mishearing for this specific game, I think, for that, with Adam, and yeah. Let's see what's, what it's got. Is it cooking? Huh? Where am I? Is this name you, or is that actually me? I think I've been here before. Move the character with the arrow button. Okay. Can I use WASD? No. So it's just arrow keys. I prefer WASD. Do I have options? Nope. We'll just say save. Why not? Watch out! That guy will blow us all because the developers told him so. What's going on here? Blow us all up or like blow us? Seriously? Be all the crap about developers? Are you an idiot? The fuck? I heard your mom is only a housewife. Did your developers told you to do so? Okay, this is... Meh, translated. Enough! I wonder what it's translated from. Whoa, when did I fall from my bed? Man, another dream. These things really put a big pressure on me sometimes. Maybe taking a walk in the park will help clear my mind a bit. Space Why aren't I wearing a shirt? Spacebar enter to interact. Shift key to run. Okay. Hmm, let's see. This will do. Okay, now I have clothes. Oh, it's because I was sleeping. Okay. My wallet is empty. Should just take some money in case anything should happen. Okay, cool. The game's a bit loud for me. Let me know if it's too loud on your end. That's a good question. It might not be... Well, I feel like... Okay, good. Uh, the copy editing, I'm not sure. I think what, with bad editing, it might just be like, um, what do you what do you call it? 
typos rather than these are just like grammatical things. Oh, disbelievers, I do not worship that which you worship, nor do you worship the one whom I worship, and neither am I going to worship that which you have worshipped, nor will you worship the one whom I worship, for you is your faith and for me my faith. Oh, I wish things were that simple here. Everything one will just think whatever they believe is right and mock others with different beliefs. Hmm. Have you seen him proclaim his allegiance to the divine system, but he denies it action? So he is the same one who pushes away the orphan and does not persuade others to feed the needy. So woe to the performances of the prayers. Whoa! Who are neglectful of their prayers, who do on good only to show off and refuse to give even small gifts? Oh! Well, you can't really interpret the things without understanding the whole context, I guess. I'm not sure even what this is. Despite everything, it's still just me. My mom used to play this whenever she got the time. Where are you going, son? I'm just gonna take a walk, mom. Hmm, while you're at it, can you buy some coffee at the store next door? Sure thing, dad. Be home before dinner. So I gotta get coffee on my walk. Hey, I'm reading this book. Find other books and shelves you want something to read. I just want to see what you're reading. Oh my, I forgot to give you the money, didn't I? Don't worry about that, Dad. No, no, here, take this. Come on, it's not like I don't drink coffee, too. Well, if you say so. I mean, I guess that's the way to do it, like, in real life with your family, but I'm just like, no, man, get the money. Come on. Shelf is full of Mom's Dad's books. There are other books upstairs, though. Okay. It's Mom and Dad's room. Can't go poking around in their stuff. It's like a solid Pokemon house. It's like your room, one room upstairs for you. At least in this one, it puts in like your parents' room. That's something that not a lot of like early uh, RPGs did ever. It's just like, nope, your room is upstairs and then there is a kitchen. Like there's still no bathrooms. Mom and dad pushed two single beds together. Oh. Scandalous. Townsman. My wife says you guys got, you got into trouble again with the forum guys yesterday. She just ignored the immature comments from their mouth. Forum guys. Yo, I'm going on a walk, so I guess I don't have to go anywhere except for the coffee place. I have nothing to do here. Ugh. I heard about the debates between you and the forum guys yesterday. You should remember most of us are not like them. We know how to respect other people's beliefs. Okay. Forum guys. I have nothing to do here. Like online or like... Like a, like a political forum, I wonder. Yes, how can I help you? Do you have some coffee? Sure do, it'll be 50G. Got one coffee, nice. I'm, I'm assuming it would be like coffee grounds or something normally, but whatever. What do you do here? I guess I could only go in open doors. I think that's the way this game works. Okay, if I talk to that guy, what's he, what's he say? You shouldn't enter the dock now, yo. Yo, you shouldn't enter the dock now, yo. Uh, what? Boy. I don't know, I just feel like doing it. <laughs> what? Come on, it's not like there's anything for you to do here now. Okay, maybe I'll come back later. Yeah, maybe we'll beat them events for you later. <laughs> Specifically for me. 50,000. Uh, you know, that's a lot for coffee. I don't think it's 50 grand. I Probably it's like 50, I don't know, yen, which would be like 50 cents. First, like, oh, my, my wallpaper changed behind the thing and I thought it meant the day changed. Now I was like, what the fuck already? Whatever everyone said about your belief, don't let them affect you. Believe what you believe with your heart. And with your brain, of course. So this is probably going to be about, uh... Living peacefully with others of different religions, maybe? I don't know. It's kind of hard to tell. Game is a very subtle message, I know, right? <laughs> Can't tell what it's gonna try to say at all. Hey, look, a vile plume. Oh, oh shit. Hey, look, it's the terrorist. Watch out, guys. He'll blow himself up and kill us all. Seriously? What do you guys have against me? Nothing, we just hate your beliefs about the existence of developers. Okay. <laughs> it's stupid. Come on, are we gonna have this conversation again? Yeah, as long as you follow that teaching that told you to kill people. Huh. Are you guys really comparing me with those extremists just because we both believe in developers? I'm sure as someone who comes from the united region of Altamisha. 
<laughs> you won't like it when people start saying everyone in your country are idiots because you have stupid John B. Weed as your ex-president. <laughs> John B. Weed. Ugh. At least he and his people were not a bunch of idiots who got angry just because a person from hundreds of years ago was made into a caricature. Vandalizing and doing violent things just because some people express themselves using freely as a work of art is stupid. Not all of us are patient enough when somebody offends us like that. You can't generalize us like that. Besides, freedom of expression, my ass. If those people you need to offend other people just to make their works and jokes get attention, it means those people are not good artists. Or comedians. At least we're not stupid like you. Saying that in this world means the developer instead of an engine is ridiculous. Yeah, and if your developers really do exist, why the hell did they give us AI that allows us to not believe them? <laughs> it was okay. Ah, oh, seriously! Is it so hard for you guys to just respect other people's beliefs? It's not like you guys can prove that developers don't exist. Well, can you prove that they exist? You just wait and see. I'll show you all. I'll bring proof that developers do exist. This is... imagine. Imagine this. Imagine this a real conversation. Very, very subtle message. I gotta look up who, what, what background the dev of this game was. This is from, cause like, man. Hi son, how's the walk? Mom, dad. I want to go on a journey to find the proof of developer existence. This is like the normal thing to do. When somebody questions your religion, you have to go on a journey to prove God's existence. We understand what you're going through. If you want to go on that journey, go ahead. We just want you to be careful on your journey and do not forget everything we've taught you. Wow, you guys are really going to let me go that easily? I did not expect that. <laughs> did you expect us to forbid you from growing up independently? But what if, what if during the pilgrimage I left everything you taught me? Do you think that we want you to believe in developers just because we told you so? Wow. Parents that actually are, are normal about really beliefs they grew up with for a long time. Pretty sure the devil of this game is an American Protestant. Huh. Then why is it so weird? And like the whole thing about terrorism, that's that like, especially if it was developed within the past like 10 years, usually that speaks to like alluding to Islam. I don't know, man. What you're to believe is, is something that you have to find yourselves. Uh, what? Sometimes, and somehow you feel skeptical about your belief. It's fine. Sometimes skepticism is important to find the things you believe in. But I'm honestly afraid of losing my faith in developers. My belief in developers and what I've been doing in the name of developers allows me to be at peace. I don't want to lose that kind of feeling. You don't need to worry about that kind of thing. In your journey, more people will mock you for what you believe. Most of the time, they'll only say things such as, you can't prove whether developers exist or not. But remember, that no matter what people out there say to you, no NPC in this game knows 100% whether developers really do exist or not. To clarify, I'm basing that on the game. It didn't look up. Oh, okay, I was wondering. No one could give any definitive proof about it. All we could do is believe. One extra thing for me. Remember that developers don't mind work like our AI. Oh, developers' minds don't work like our AI. The limitation of our AI won't stand a chance against the mind of developers. We won't be able to comprehend everything developers made and did to this game. You may not understand it completely now, but I'm sure you'll find the answer on your journey. Okay, Mom. Dad. Wish me luck for my journey. I just need to pack a few things for leaving. Uh, by the way, Dad, here's a coffee you asked me to buy. <laughs> no, I'll just take it with you. I'm sure you'll need it somewhere in the future. But why would I... Co Come on, be a good boy, just take it with you. Okay, if you exist. Okay, well, what am I gonna pack? I should actually save the rest of my money. Time to do some packing. Done. That's it. Easiest packing. Is that all you bring with you? Yes, Mom. That's not enough. It's cold out there. You should bring your jacket and extra one in case anything happens. But, Mom. Okay, okay, I'll bring an extra jacket. Where is your extra jacket? Like, I don't know where the fuck it is. I thought she would have it for you. Where's my jacket? Oh, here it is. This should be enough. I hope. Like, no shit you need a jacket. Am I gonna take any of the sacred texts? Oh, 
Like, I suppose, like, this is definitely, like, a, a an interesting take on the nature of things. Like, I guess, like, nobody thinks that they're going to be, like, the nature of whether or not determinism exists or not is such a, a, a debate that has, like, no winners, really. Because it's, like, on the one hand, if you believe in complete free will, that means, like, everything you do, like, is based on nothing, necessarily. Because, like, the, the fact that things have an effect is... Oh, hold on, let me... I'm gonna... No, I don't want to do that. Where is my fucking... I just looked over and, like, realized that I can put the the game chat somewhere, like, less... more visible, I guess. Actually, let's put it, uh, right above me. Yeah, that's a... that's a good place. I'll move it again another time. Like, if, you, or if you're like, no determinism, everything you do is, is, is your own thing, but like, you make your decisions based on, like, things that you, you say. So like, the decisions you make are determined by like, things you've seen and know and physics and stuff like that. But if you're like, okay, well, everything is determined then because everything you do is based on like your brain chemistry, which is based on what you ate, which is based on genetics, then it's like, technically you have no free will and that fucking sucks. So like, the only thing we could do is ignore it. Haha. <laughs> now you're all set. Let me look it up. Well, what, what, what is it? Just be careful out there. I forgot what we taught you. I just said that, like... I was afraid of forgetting that, and you were like, it's okay. Now I'm not sure where to go. Hmm, the port seems like a good place to start. Like, everything in this, this guy's life is... Fairly determined by... Yeah, I see. The news about the tsunami that strikes Faith Beach is shocking, yo. Everything about this guy's life is determined, yes, by the developers and also by me. So, like, I get to influence, like, little bits of, like, what he does. But, like, ultimately I can only work within the world which the developers made and the story that the developers wrote. Like, I can't control what he says or anything. The only ship available now is a ship that will bring volunteers and rations to Faith Beach. You talk to the captain near the ship if you're interested in being a volunteer. Okay. I'm busy now. Just talk to the captain if you need anything. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, so that's not a real building. Okay, I think that's the captain. Let's see what's on this side. I have some relatives in Faith Beach. I hope they're alright. I hope so too. I admit that I guessed very wrong. <laughs> I mean, I'm not saying, I'm not, I, like, I'm not gonna say that I completely thought you were wrong, but I was like, I, I was pretty much, Dev is Mohammed Faimi and lives in Indonesia, apparently. Okay, that looks, that's, that sounds, that pretty much tracks for what I expected. I was like, this definitely is probably uh, related to struggles and having an Islamic faith with this stupid, like, um, really Western... Uh, hegemony that's going on with like faith and belief in Islamophobia, but where specifically it was from, I was like, could be anywhere. There's Muslims everywhere. Fucking fine now. This ship will take you to the Faith Beach. We will bring rations and volunteers there. Care to join us? I'm not just going there, but I'm not sure whether I, I will be a volunteer or not. Can I just board the ship to go there? Well, it's okay if you want to board that ship, but you have to pay. Even some of the volunteers pay to fund the sailing and buy rations for the victims there. Victims? Oh yeah, there's a tsunami. Okay, is 500 grand, uh, 500 gold enough? Should be okay. Talk to me again when you're ready to go. Yeah, like what else am I gonna do? Wow, this ship looks sure looks bigger inside. I guess I could just sleep until we reach Faith Beach, or should I explore the ship? We're gonna explore. Alright, I'll look around for a while. Random dude that loves to break the fourth wall. <laughs> Good choice, you may find some interesting side quests on this ship. Oh, and please don't call me random dude that loves to break the fourth wall. Just call me Quattro. Okay. Guessing American Protestants can sometimes get very defensive even though they're in fact the majority. Maybe, like... The guys from the forum are supposed to be the, like, like American Protestants or something. Because he fully does it, like, you're from the United whatever thing. So I'm like, okay, he's alluding to people from the States, but I don't know. We should try to look around first. If I'm not saying there is a spoken hot girl smoking at the balcony. You should check her out. Okay, double smoking. He's sleeping. Is there anything out here? I don't have anything to do here. I 
Oh, my knowledge can be used to help the people in Faith Beach. Sure. Sleeping. An FBG has certain tolerance and respect. Source relates. Okay, I'll read that after off, which you probably know I'll do, obviously. There surely needs someone to work on all the broken hardware to continue living there. Sure. Sleeping. Sleeping. Oh, there's the smoking hot girl smoking on the balcony. What does this guy say? Sorry, but you can't leave this cabin until we arrive at Faith Beach. Oh, like I can't go. Okay, fine. I just wanted to, like, going down isn't going to be any. People sleeping, people sleeping, people sleeping. Yeah, I wasn't expecting you to read entire probably gone. Oh, no. Like, I mean, I could, because some people do that. Like, stream is for whatever. Like, when you're a popular streamer, like, you could really do whatever you want. Like, people, people will just kind of do whatever. And they just want to hang out. So that's kind of nice. But, yeah, no. I don't know. For now, I can only pray and hope for the best for those people. Sleeping? Sleeping. Can't steal anything. I said I'd find a couple side quests. Pop you can also do that. If, if I'm ever a popular streamer. I don't know. Like, it's not exactly my goal to do that. Even though, like, that kind of is the goal of streaming. Because you want to interact with people while you do stuff. But, you know. Yeah. Wow, that looks really pretty. I should try talking to her. On second thought, she'll think I'm a creep if I just come to her. Why? I should find a topic to approach her. That girl? You saw me trying to approach her. She must be thinking I'm a total creep now. I didn't even... I was just gonna say hi. Okay. My dance surely will raise the morales of both the victims and the volunteers. No matter how bad the situation is, everyone needs a good laugh to ease their minds. I hope my music can bring joy to the people there. Like, what have you got to lose? I know, right? Like, you kind of just do anything. I may not look like it, but I'm actually a chef. Oh, okay. Can't just approach her and say hello. Hmm, that guy in my room sees no lot. Maybe I should ask for advice. Just fucking talk to people. Clown voice is amazing. The more, the more silly I can make a voice, the better it is, because I get to, like, ham it up more. Hey, man, can I ask a question? Sure, you want to know how to approach that random cutie on the balcony, right? What? How'd you know? Me, her, some doors, and some random one-liner NPCs are the only objects you can interact with in this area. And I'm sure you're not really interested in knowing about more of those one-liners. Or the doors. Uh, how can you be so sure? I mean, the people here are quite interests. This is a minor thing. The point is, my guess is correct, right? W well, yeah. I don't know. You didn't change the name of this. This is supposed to be me right now. I don't really know how I know all about this, but it seems you can help me here. Of course I can! Bring the fourth wall is my job in this game! <laughs> Luckily, lucky you, I have this game guide with me here. You should be able to find a way to approach her here. Cool, can I borrow it? Only if I have coffee in your inventory. <laughs> what? Why would you need a coffee here? I don't really need it, but it's the only side quest you got until this point. Whatever, man, I guess my pop is right. I'll need some coffee at some point in my journey. Cool, here, take this. You received game guide. Thanks! Hmm, let's take the random cutie section. It says, just approach her by saying, hello, man up. <laughs> That's what I said. Oh, I guess you should really try to be brave. Hey, thanks a lot for the guide, man. Anytime, dude. You returned the game guide. You should have kept it. You traded coffee for that, man. I mean, I guess you just... Like, you didn't even learn anything. Like, I could have told you that. Also, yeah, we don't really have an inventory. Uh, hello. Yeah? Is there anything I can help you with? Okay, I give up. I didn't even know the proper process for this, how the kind of thing that goes. So let's just skip and pretend that everything went well for the main character. Wow. So here we are. The other reason I thought it sounded like American Protestant on the other side is apparently atheism, the word created by a random engine, not a developer. I don't have a genomotic religion. Oh, I thought, I didn't realize, like, that that was a, a thing that they kind of talked about there. Whereas, like, I imagine, like, the engine is kind of like the game engine, right? So, it was still just a different entity, but I don't know. So here we are, Faith Beach Refugee Camp. Yeah, here we are. We'll go to the disaster scene tomorrow morning, so maybe you can look around and get to know the villagers a bit. That's a good idea. This is a refugee camp. You can look around before the briefing tomorrow evacuation. Okay. I know I'm handsome and cool, but you should try talking to other people in this area. I'm so handsome and cool. Okay, so there's nobody there.
Wait, how do I get off this fucking thing? Oh, what the fuck? But it looks elevated. What the hell? Okay, sure. These aren't Yaka. Yeah, okay. Is that the same girl I was talking to? Not so random, cutie. I really love standing barefoot on the beach while feeling the breeze. I don't know why I pissed just let that just got hit by a disaster and feel so peaceful and calming. By the way, have you decided whether you will become a volunteer or not? After seeing the disaster scene from the ship this morning, I think I'll help out around a bit. I don't know how long I'll be here, though. Besides, I should forget the main objective of my journey. Ah, uh, about that. You should try talking to some of the villagers here. I'm sure you'll be able to think of something afterward. Huh? What do you mean? Just try talking to them. Uh, okay, I'll try. Hey, can we the number of victims aren't as many as the tsunami disaster ten years ago. That's good. This tent will be in my emergency workshop. I need to make some calculations about the optimal method of evacuation, and after the evacuation is done, I'll stay here for a while to open an emergency school. This is a reminder to us that we are nothing compared to the other higher power in this world. Even though I'm a villager at Faith Beach, I don't want to stand still and wait for help. I'll join the evacuation team tomorrow. Because doing good things for other people is something that the developers want from us. Oh, it doesn't mean that everything I do, do is for the sake of de getting developers' attention, though. Okay. They told me this will be the emergency kitchen. I guess I need to change the proper attire and start cooking soon. Most of our belongings have been swept by the waves. I guess it's a reminder that everything in this world is only temporary. Most of the clothes we wear now are from the disaster release. Oh. Hmm, the villagers seem to be pretty calm about what happened. They really believe that all of this are the works of the developers, therefore they believe it happens within its own reason. I know Faith Beach is full of people with faith, but I didn't know their faith is this strong. Maybe Quattro knows the reasons for this. Man, we're not done talking to everybody. Hi, and this is the tent on- and this- uh, this and the tent on the left are emergency tent. The wounded and sick people are treated here. Can I go in? No, I can't. Not real tents. <laughs> that clown is so funny. Spreading happiness to anyone, these guys are the best. Hooray! The dancer is very beautiful. I want to be like her someday. My twin sister wants to be like that dancer, but I want to be a musician like that cool guy. People said the clown is stupid and funny, but I think he's the coolest among the group. Wow! I love them all! They make us happy! Okay, that's good. Sing, sing to your heart's content! Wow, they really like my dance! Seeing their enthusiasm makes me forget about my fatigue. They really love our performances! That's good. That's professionals for you. Can I go... I don't have anything to do in the better part of the island, not yet at least. Sure, okay. I'll go talk to fucking Quattro again. Turns out Quattro is like... The devs insert. Have you talked to the people here? Yes, I have, and I'm kind of surprised to see how well they relate this tragedy with their faith. It amazes me how strong their faith is. Well, maybe it's because this place is so close with the location of the credit tablet. The what? Credit tablet? What's that? Oh, it's a stone tablet with the name of developers inscribed on it. Some people believe it's the proof of the developers' existence. What? Do you know where is the tablet's location? Yeah, I heard it's located inside a cave in the forest about two kilometers north from here. Do you want to check it yourself? Yes. Yes, I want to check it with my own eyes. Well, hold your horses, boy. It's a little far, but if you let go now, you may be able to reach the place and return here before sunset. Okay, I'll be going now then. I just need to take the path of the little fences up there, right? Yeah, from there just follow the road and you should be able to reach the cave easily. Okay, thanks for the info. Usually, like, the credit thing is in, like, a city somewhere. It's not, like, in a corner of the thing. And I guess, like, that's just the nature of this current game. Alright, off we go! Wait! Huh? Quattro, what's the matter? I was just thinking, maybe we should go with you. Okay, what's with the sudden decision, though? I don't know, I just feel like doing it. You don't mind my company, right? Of course I don't mind. Great, so should we go now? Definitely. Yeah, I have nothing else to do here. Around two kilometers of walking. This must be the place they talk about. We need to check out the place fast so we can return to the others early. I mean, like, do we, though? I guess this isn't a game where I get to pick stuff up. Can I climb up that? No, I can't.
Here it is, the credit tablet I've been telling you before. What's up with this plant in the corner? I don't know. Hmm, there are several things written on it. It's kind of hard to read it, but I think it says... A game by Mohamed Fahmi. Fahmi Hatsni. Art by Garakun.dyardart.com. Music by Diamond16, there's the DC Kyrie Seller, Mark Grammy Makish. Okay. This is it! This might be the proof of the developer's existence. But of course, it's far from what you call definitive proof. I should have realized this from the start. But there's no way I could ever find definitive proof of the developer's existence. Hmm, you already told me about your stories. But I was just curious. Why do you really need to find definitive proof of the developer's existence? Well, I'm not even sure myself. I Maybe mean, if I can find a proof of developer's existence, people will stop making fun and judging my religion. That's ridiculous. Whatever you do, people will always find something bad to talk. That's true. That is sad. That is real. The best thing you could do is just be patient and prove them that whatever you believe has taught you to be a better person. That's a really good point, actually. Besides, if you look at how the villagers of Faith Beach live, they'll rarely care about what you believe in, as long as you're a good person. Really? I don't know about that. For first time here, I thought most of them are believers of developers. Well, it's true that most of them are believers, but there are also some non-believers there, and yet I heard never heard any bad news that comes from this difference. As far as I know, they live with, with a lot of principles they learn from their belief. But among all the principles they believe in, one of my favorite is... The best thing you can do to people with different beliefs is to show respect to them, and the worst thing you can do is not care about it at all. So even if you meet someone with a belief you disagree with, you shouldn't offend them just because you have different views on how we should live. As long as your belief is not messing with other people's lives, of course. You're right. Why should I care so much about some vocal minority? There are others who have different beliefs with me, and yet they can respect what I believe without making any silly assumptions or stereotypes. But does this mean that my journey to find the proof of developer's existence is pointless? Of course not. You just started your journey and you already learned something important and met some new people. You're right. I'm sure if I continue this journey, I'll be able to learn more about life. How to deal with people, of course. So what are you going to do now? For now, I'll help around here and learn from the people in this place. After that, who knows? <laughs> okay. We better return to the camp before they start sending search team for us. <laughs> I think they'll be busy watching the performance from the dancers and musicians to think about us. It's quite possible, actually. This is very... Is that it? <laughs> this is very, like, looks at the camera and delivers... Delivers a lesson. Damn. I didn't even... I barely need to, like, save anything. Yeah, the game is only supposed to be 20 minutes. Yeah. I suppose it is. Well, let's get another one. It's, we've, we're only in, like, less than an hour in. God damn. Let me... Stream marker. What is the next on my list? 1365. I think this is actually... A horror game, which is early, but... Why not? Uh... Let's see. Do 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 do. I don't have stop and talking, flickering music, sound effects, game speed. That was like the fastest ever any game ever loaded. There is no full screen though, so let me just get back onto. Where's my game? Now this is gonna be a window capture thing or a game capture thing. 1365. And we're gonna have to uh, fit the screen and then transition over and get that. Oh, wait, I should probably. Yeah. Like, I mean, that that last game was... It was fine. <laughs> it was just very, like, ham-fisted. At least this rate you'll clear your game backlog. <laughs> That's what I'm hoping for the, in this slot. But we'll see. Some of these I don't know how long they're supposed to take. And definitely stuff like uh, Dev Theism I put in to just, like, get through as it goes. Let's start. This is... This is a pot... Uh, Cicada C freshman. Do I have? Oh, okay. Hello. My name is Anxiety. Here on your shoulder. Oh. Hello, Anxiety. This is your first day of high school.
I guess it goes as, as I go far. You don't belong here. I don't? Oh, it's because it's anxiety talking. Okay, true. You remember how it was last year? You're just gonna do everything wrong. Well... Oh, hey, look. Courage. Go back. Guilt dysphoria. Ah, dysphoria. Extra complications of things. I don't think you understand. I'm just trying to protect you. It's dangerous. That, that's also dysphoria. Okay. They'll hurt you, but, they don't, but you can't avoid them. The only way out is to give up. I don't want to deal with dysphoria right now. It sucks. Ooh, shit. The only way out is to give up. Don't take that. You don't deserve it. Wow. This is also rather ham-fisted. But I guess, like, there's a mouse point. Yeah, yeah, that was... If my mouse was on it, that's just kind of how it looks like. Why don't you quit? Expectation. Like, bad expectations? Or... Whoa. Look, this expectation is too high. You can't possibly... Yes, I can. Ow. Well, I made it anyway. Now I'm here. I'm here, bitch. Whoa. Oh, there we go. There's no point. Stop. We got patience. I'm glad I'm not in high school anymore. Day 546. In 2014, man. Are you listening? Fucking no. Insomnia. Oh, that's the that's the real killer. Ooh. Okay, uh, how am I gonna... Yeah. You don't get it. And that's not that. You deserve it anyways. It's too high. Identity. Ooh. Depression. Oh, God. Am I supposed to go up? I don't want to deal with depression. Fuck. I wish this speech bubble would get out of the way. This inside out tie-in game we needed. I know, right? You can't make those jumps. Uh, I can't see the fucking dysphoria because you keep being in my way. Maybe that's a part of it. You know, I don't care. I'm just gonna run straight into dysphoria because fucking... That's enough. You can't go any farther. I swear anxiety is not... Well, I don't know. Maybe that's just this person's anxiety. Is not that active. Fuck! It's a good thing that I'm so hard headed. I also like. Ah, oh, for fuck's sake. Like, I don't even give a shit about the dysphoria anymore. God damn it. It's really hard to make that tiny. Like, maybe I'm gonna kill myself. Whatever. Okay, I have to be at the end of this. Okay. How oh, this game teaches you to overcome your negative emotions. Seems like it. Where are you going? Solid snake in it. In the bush. I, I kind of wish I could jump. Hold on. About... In 2016, just before I graduated from high school, I was asked to make a presentation in my last 1365 days at school. I realized I couldn't really remember thanks to my mental illnesses. That's that's real. So instead, I made a game about what I could remember. A hostile world, bleak and full of inescapable monsters, but a world that I had just made it out of in one piece. 1365 is a reflection of my own struggles in overcoming anxiety, depression, other such monsters of the mind, specifically in the context of public school. While my understanding of myself and my world have changed drastically since I first started work on this game, I opted to keep the original concept intact. I've remade the original game entirely and added a few features that I didn't have time for, but otherwise, the game is a time capsule to three years ago when I finished its first incarnation. Nearly every part of 1365 was made by me, including graphic sound code writing concept. The only parts that weren't were the font, which is Little Monster by Jack Oatley, and the game engine itself built by the Godot team. I couldn't have done it without them. So three years after its initial creation, I'm proud to present 1365. I hope you enjoy playing it as much as I enjoyed making it. Okay. I was hoping that there was going to be, like, controls, other than, like, fucking uh, the, the arrow keys. 
you're like, I don't even care about it. Which is kind of how you got to deal with it after a while. Like, if you don't, like, if it don't get you, you just have to be like, man, fuck it. Who cares? Now look what you done. What, what did I do? Do you actually expect to make it up this? Yeah. What? Like, I want to get mad at the speech bubble for being in the way, but I guess that's its purpose. Can't make it past the dysphoria and insom in insomnia because of the fucking anxiety. 819. 2015! Dead end. Time to go home. Wee! Stop! You could have gotten yourself killed, but I didn't. Eh, there's nothing for you here. You're not supposed to be here. You idiot. Never listening. Never thinking. All this time I tried to do is help. Have you, though? We. Oui. Enough of that, I say. Oh, shit. Fall. Isn't this lovely? See where disobedience got you. It's hilarious that you're still trying. I wonder if I'm actually supposed to be able to jump that before at all. There's no way out. You did this to yourself. This is kind of what it's like. Alone, lost, worthless. What are those hiding in the dark? They're just like you, cowards, too afraid to show themselves. How fitting. Let that coward should meet their end to another coward. Matter of time now. Fills you with determination! You actually think you can fight back? Adorable. They'll win the end. I'll win the end. Damn. I wonder if we'll actually die. Continue. Stop. What do we give up? Give up already. Wouldn't it be nice to stop fighting? Wouldn't it be nice to stop trying? Wouldn't it be nice to just give in? Oh, totally. Was that an Undertale reference? What I was talking about was... I only wanted to protect you. I only wanted to help. So I guess anxiety is this... It's like a snake thing? 1365 days. 1365 ways to say goodbye. 1365 days which are still alive. It's a wonder you made it this far. Quit while you're ahead. What are you doing? Go back. The Cicada Carpenter. Fonts, Little Monster. So this is another like 15 minute game, I guess. Open Disliked by Abby Gonzalez, Liberation Sounds by Red Hat. Special thanks, Blair, Hollow, Brandy, Minute. Everyone who debug the players for believing in me. Thanks to Godot, Mini 2 dx Gimp, Tiled, Isprite. Shouldn't have done it without you. I don't know how much time I left up to you, and gonna keep kicking till the bitter end. As long as I'm here, I'm winning. It won't be easy, but then, life never was, and I know that I'm in not alone. I can't let my demons win over me. There's still something worth fighting for. There's still everything worth fighting for. You keep fighting too. Yep. Can I? Yeah. Okay. Hilariously, it went to a one minute ad break for me right as the last game. Oh man. I should have. I should have looked over to see if it was because I can postpone the ad breaks if I'm paying attention. But I haven't. <laughs> I didn't. I'm sorry. But yeah, that game was pretty good. Like, it's just as ham fisted as the other one. It's just people making short essays about this is what I'm struggling and with, and this is my thing, and I'm going to make a game out of it, which is kind of what indie games are all about. That game was even faster. Like, legit. That was like, was that even like 10 minutes? I don't know. Be done on all in no time. I know, right? Okay, so the next one we're going to do is cat lateral damage which might take a bit longer i know this is like nothing like the previous two this is gonna be like it's like a simulator it's a simulator of just like knocking shit over because i know that it was like kind of popular ish with some streamers a little while ago because it's just fucking chaos but we'll see we'll see how it goes for me just give me give me a second to try to get it going Did I put the stream marker? 
Let's just do another one just in case. If there's two close together, then I'll know that I fucked up and it's fine. Uh, cats. In stark opposition to the last one, this is taking time to load. Whoa. Okay, let's see. Well, it seems to be fine the way it is now. Oops. Well, let's hope that I can get it to latch on. I gotta... Hold on. Uh. Oh, now I gotta fucking edit the thing. That's right. Uh... Well, there we go. Now we can actually go. Tutorial. Oh, wait. Need Discord up. Did I not? Oh, I have to close it. I'm sorry this keeps happening. I'm trying my best. Let's learn how to play cat lateral damage. Knock objects onto the floor. Okay. I like the cursor being like my little kitty face. Wazd, jump space. Okay. Ah. Yay. So it's almost like Katamari in that like you you're sort of collecting the items that you interact with a little bit. Get out. Yay. Can I go? Wow. We need... What's in here? I'm a kitty. I'm a kitty. And I'm doing kitty things. Can I make that? Oh, I can. Get out of there. Yeah. Oh, shit. Ooh, that's a part. That's a thing. Get out of here. Oh, there is another thing. No. Ah! So I need the pot. Oh, I can knock over the picture frame. Get out of here. Ah! New photo unlocked. Nippy. Oh, is that the cat that this is based off of? Click on the box to continue. Oh, jump in the box. Yay! Cat training. The dev of Death Nation was also the main developer of Coffee Talk. Oh, interesting. I have Coffee Talk, but I haven't managed to uh, get to it yet. Now go make some messes. Okay. I've only got 12 hours of sleep. Time to make a mess. Literally me today. <laughs> 290 objects. Ah. Get, get out and get out of here. Fuck you. I don't know what that is. Fuck you. Get out. I wonder if there are any consequences to my actions. I'm sure we'll find about, out about them in time. Get out of here! Fuck off! Who are all of you in my domain? Get- go! Ah! Socks! Socks! Nom 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 socks. What is this? What is this is a coat hanger. That's a new thing. I don't know what those discs are. Hopefully not plates for like the owner's sake, but... Oh. This game also teaches a valuable lesson. Cats are evil. Cats have their own... Event? What's the event? A free upgrade has appeared. Where? Where is that? Ooh, kitty picture. What is that? What is that? Oh. Jump increased! Yay! Knocking shit over. 
I have better jump. Whee! Ooh, that's a challenge. How am I gonna get that out? Well... Does it count as knocking them on the floor if they're already on the floor? Get out of here. Turns out if your cat has been evil, it's because it's being possessed by the likes of me. This is the worst thing a cat could possibly knock over. I think that's the fear. It's like you were actually, you, the thing was on and then your cat went on. <gasps> I can get in the oven? Yay. This is incredibly bad. I can get in the fridge. Whee! Get out of here. This is my fridge now. Fucking get out. I told you to get out. Get out! What's the, what's all this shit? Fuck out of here! You're not allowed! Nobody is allowed on the surfaces except for me! Is this a surface? Then get out! Okay, I feel like I need a power-up to get... Oh, I broke it. Okay, so I guess I'm allowed to, to break things. How do I get this shit out of here? Whatever, I broke the plate. I guess that's like the main takeaway. Oh shit, I knocked over my own light in real life. That's just the spirit of the game. Okay, I see. Can I get up there with this new increased jump of mine? I could definitely- uh. No, I can get in the shelves. Oh! Fell in the oven! No cook me. Not, not yet. Let me finish my dark- my dark purposes. No! Can I make- can I push the chair? I hope I can. Never mind. It doesn't matter. This is like that one bird from- there's like a TikTok of people that have like bird- this bird that likes to find its way into- that- I think it was actually by accident that the bird found itself- found its way into um, their fucking- what do you call it? Their glasses cabinet. And it was just like having a fucking time. It was just so proud of itself. What? What is it? What's the event? Oh! Ah! Scary power outage! Whoa! Yeah, yeah, yeah. No upgrade. Oh. Where 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 to go? More jump! Yay! Ah the power! Ah the power! Ah! I'm extra knocking things over because I'm so scared. I'm so scared. So scared of no power, even though I can see in the dark because I'm a cat. Don't think about that. We. I gotta finish up this room. Did it... I don't think it went on the floor. Can I. That's like fucking. This game just got. You leave guys with the before it said I can get in the oven. <laughs> I love to get into places that I'm not allowed. I'm a cat. It feels special. Get out of here. Go. Okay. We ah. Uh, can I? Yes, yes, yes. Open. Open. Do not deny me my birthright. Ah. Uh... You are all my subjects. I am your lord. Your dark lord. Okay, uh... uh... Where am I? No, I didn't make it. You can- yeah, we're in here. Get all the clothes. Everybody on the dance floor. Everybody on the dance floor. If you ain't getting drunk, get the fuck out the club. Okay, let's see if I can do one of these. Ooh! Even better tech than I thought I would be able to do. Get out. All you. All you. What the fuck? Oh. Oh, fuck. I didn't realize that my time was that bad. Uh. I gotta get the photos. Ten seconds. Uh, 
Uh, uh, wait, get out of here. Uh, did I lose? Game over score one, two, five, final total. I've just toppled. Okay, so now I realize that I gotta do quality over quantity. Choose a cat, Nippy, Lynn, Will. Let's be Will. Especially too long now. Cranky, time to make a mess. Yay! Bonus is water bottles, and extra is for 33 bucks. Is it like randomly generated? I know I got an upgrade based on the scratching post last time, so let's see if I can get that again. Yay! Where to go? Speed increased. Love that. Okay, so I need water bottles and books, which or the blue books specifically. What is that? That's interesting. Okay, let's actually start hunting for things. Hmm. If I was a water bottle, where would I be? I'm in the oven again. As is my right. Uh, not up there. There are bottles, but not water bottles. Oh, I was in there. Whatever. You know what? Let's, let's start looking around, see what we got. Oh, obviously we got a fucking play with the toilet paper. Where are we? What? What event? Moon gravity. Oh, shit. You cat unlock Gris World. Oh, fuck. It's too easy to float, but I need the landing to be able to get anywhere. Okay. I think these are the books that I needed. I hope. Not really. Oh, it's just taking them f fucking forever to actually land. What was I doing before I got... Oh, the toilet paper. We. Come on. New upgrade. Where? Uh. What is it? Uh, the gravity. SWAT increased. Okay, cool. Where else? Okay, we're out of moon gravity. It's fine. Can we open these? You remember? You just somehow lose and knock things over again. I just didn't knock things enough, I guess. Like, I won in my heart, but I lost in, in, in sheer amounts. I lost in the knock everything over game. Because I did not knock everything over. I can get out of here. Go. Okay, let's see if I can make this jump. Yeah! I like wanted to methodically stay in like the same room the whole time, which might still be a good idea. Oh! These are not over. I think I spent too much time dealing with things that were, like, more difficult. Rather than, like, going for the easy things like, say, these. Oh, there's stuff on the bed, too, instead of on the floor. Okay, hold on. Get, 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 oh! Let's get all these, all these out of here. The bed is my place to be. That's where I started. You can't, you can't claim that. You're not allowed. It's cultural appropriation being on the bed. Get out. Get out! I only have so much time! You guys are literally assaulting me with your being on top of things. Only I can be on top of things. Where are all those water bottles that are supposedly around? These are not the books that I need, I don't think. No. I gotta figure this shit out. 
What's in here? Oh. Oh, hell. Get out. CC! New photo unlocked. I hear the number one mod for this game is people modding it so that their own cats are like the ones to uh, the the ones to be the knocking over cat, which is so real. If there was like a dog for this, I'd be like, make it Pancho. I want to play game with my Pancho. Okay, uh, where are these fucking water bottles? I got all of these goddamn books. I got 30 seconds left. But I don't know where the fucking water bottles are. Ugh. I'm somehow gonna lose the knocking things over game again. Because I'm not entirely sure how to knock things over better than I already do, because I thought I was already a pro. I don't know how I'm managing this, but... Oh, you're still here. Get out. Get out! Aww. Well, I lost it all. Level 1, level 2. Like, I can't even get past level 1. There are options. Credits. Great by Chris Chung. Well, there isn't a whole lot much more to the game. This is just like sandbox mode, never mind. Collection, achievements, cat training complete, knock over a thousand objects, knock over five thousand objects, objective pro, complete two thousand more object objects, objects, appliance? You can knock over appliances! Photos, CC, and kitty game, artifact, is there like a Katamari start uh, style entry for these? No, it's just it just lists them. Oh well. Like this is something that I definitely like to play a bit more. Nautagen, is there a goal in this game or just a cat simulator? Oh hi Nautagen. I think it's just cat simulator. Like there is an objective. So like if I go in objective mode and I pick ooh, who I got, Sar Griswold. Let's be Griswold. So like. I have to... I really want to try to get... Like, yeah, it says get 250 objects, and then it gives you, like, specific bonuses for objects. So you know what? We are going to actually try to focus instead of getting distracted, which... I don't know if that's gonna work because I'm a cat in-game and sort of mentally in real life. But we will focus on getting all the fucking books possible, because those are the easiest things to, to get. Problem is I keep, like, not really... minding my motions well enough. The goal is to knock things over. Yeah, it's, the goal is to knock a lot of things over, but I don't know if we get anything if we knock enough stuff over, because I've never managed to do it really well. Uh, so I know that there's... Ah, there we go. Oh, come on. Here we go. So now it's the green books that are that are the goal. I should start at the top and then move down. I feel like that's like the better thing to do. Is there another shelf? I don't think so. Um, yeah, let's go into the kitchen. It's like three bookends. What? What is it? I'm busy. A free upgrade. Ooh. Where, where is it? Uh, give me. Jump increased. I guess I if I interact with the cat toys, I get, get free upgrades. Where is it? Where is it? What? Speed increased. Okay. Important. Okay, these are not the books that I need, so I should stop getting distracted. But the they do have the bookends that I need. And get out of here. There we go. Is there something that happens when I get enough bookends, I wonder? Fucking, it's still on top of the couch! On top of things is my domain!
There we go. New upgrade. Swat increased. Miss Kitty Rinne. Okay, where... Where am I going? Ugh, I think I need higher jump to get up there. Ed! Unless... Nope, I do need higher jump. Okay, let's... Wait, what's this? Is this my higher jump? Wait, where is it? Give me, give me, where's the upgrade? Yeah, speed, okay, whatever. I don't care. Ugh. Where are all those books that I'm looking for? Wait, I didn't go in there. Hold on. What? I'm busy. Move, grab. Oh, I gotta go get that. Wait, also, there's a, bo oh, a book I need here. Get out. Gotta go get that shelf on the top. Eh. We. Yes, we have the books that I need. And also the bookends. We. Okay. Nope. Oh. You will pay for this. This slight. Against my kitty self. Okay. Uh. Eleven seconds till. Till lack of. Kitty gravity. Till increase in kitty gravity. Wait. There we go. Okay. I win. No, I don't. There's still, like, so much stuff. Ugh, this stuff is- you know what? Fuck it. I'm gonna go somewhere else. Fuck you. Plant. Give me upgrade, plant. We're- we're upgrade. Ugh. Jump increase. Uh. Get out of here. Where are those- the rest of the books? I'm trying my best! What was I doing before? Oh, some of them are on the chair. Fuck you. That was the problem. still didn't get it. So I think I'm gonna move on. Because, I don't know, final total 196. What was the, the goal? I forget, it was like 200 and something? I mean, I guess. Like, there really is not a whole lot of thing to this. Let's continue. Let's just have a look at the, the faces we got. Oh, we didn't get any more. Well, whatever. The goal was 250. Yeah, we were kind of far from the goal. I don't know what would make it easier for me specifically but i don't know it's kind of fun for what it is because it's just legitimately like knocking things over and being like ah whatever but it's not gonna carry on for too much more with being particularly interesting so that's another one down stream marker it was fun it was at least enjoyable you know the next game is called don't move which i have here uh Let's change this f first. I feel like this you know, the cat lateral damage was popular on for streamers for a while, but I can't see why it would be that popular for too long. It was just like, do you mean don't starve? And like, why would they make such a silly game so hard? It wasn't that hard. I feel like if I really focused on it, it could have been like fine, but I don't know. I don't know. I get to 
put back all my stuff that I knocked over on my own desk. Did I update it properly? Yeah, there we go. Uh, where is... Don't move. Okay, I gotta... I don't know if I can... Uh, hold on. I don't know if I'm going to be able to go into the menu, so I better just try to put it up from here. Don't move. I got to make it fit screen and then one window. Press left or right to start. Ah! Okay. Well, I mean, the game is don't move. I know that's part of it, but like... I'm pretty sure there's more to it than just don't move, right? Hold on, let me... I have to get Discord back. Upgrades waste of time, I don't think they're worth it. I'm not sure, because like, the jump upgrades were definitely the better ones. But, like, all this other ones, like, I don't know. I'm just interested in how... Oh. Okay, so, do I die at distance 162? 500. What the fuck was that? Clearly something happened. If I go slow. I'm wondering what's killing me specifically. I don't have a jump exactly. Oh shit, that just closed the game. I hope that I would have like a like an actual menu. Hmm. Five hundred distance. Damn it. Okay, if I go... I actually die faster if I don't go... Uh. Okay, let's just go fast. Okay, what is... 164 seconds. Oh, medals. What the fuck? What are you getting medals in? 15 medals. Attempts, 18. Okay, so that I think the first one is for attempts. Will I get more... If I have, like... Uh. I guess the time just goes up no matter what. What is this game? I'm not sure. It's just called Don't Move. So, like, part of it is, like, I guess I'm not supposed to move. But, like, it's unclear how much I will get by just not moving. Oh, what was that? Oh, it's for the time. So, I get one. So, I'm going to have to get to 15 medals. And I guess one of the fastest way to do that is to just keep running and increase the distance and the attempts. Zag on him. Because I think... Uh, will it be 60 or 75? Level up. What the fuck? 10 levels. Okay, so I get more experience the more I move. Which is counterintuitive to the fucking... Game. But... Nice. Is it a certain amount of distance that I just die at every time? Okay, so 2, 205. It's 2, 2, 3, 4. So that's about like... Uh, fucking math. Like, 29 every time. 
but I can kind of make it increase by like going slow. Kind of? Do I? I don't know. Again, like I also like... It's better if I just keep going and dying. There's a lot of interesting games in this world, y'all. But people just be making whatever out here. I get passive experience if I don't do anything. I'm like... See, the game is like... Do, do you just actually not move and get experience for doing the thing the game says? Or do you interact with it even though that is kind of, I guess, technically a loss? But is that a loss? Is that a win? I don't know. Ten levels. That's a lot of levels. Yeah, and the experience is harder. Is it 250 every time? I wish I could jump. I would feel so much better if I could jump. 3,000 distance! Wow! Oh, 100 attempts coming up. Let's see if I can get to that, like, real quick. 100! I didn't get a medal for that? Come on. It's a hundred attempts. I have put like 500 seconds into this at least. XP requirement went up. Damn. I guess that's how XP requirements work. But it's still annoying. 490. Uh. This hold left. I'm glad this isn't louder than it is. We got 20 medals, though. I'm surprised the attempts medal don't, doesn't go up as much as it, I think it should, but I guess because we're going to make a lot of attempts, it can be. This game looks pretty bad. I'm hoping it goes somewhere, because at least it isn't hard to progress a little bit. It's somehow fun to play. I don't think it's about like the gameplay, it's about the discovery of it. So what I see with a lot of different games is that like it's either about socializing is about gameplay it's about discovery or it's about like achievements so this is kind of achievements but also discovery because there's not much to fucking gameplay like at all it's just like can you can go left or right and the game says don't it's called don't move so i guess it's is this just a weird clicker game like in a way i'm not really clicking though i'm just going left or right i want to see like we're at level nine so we'll see what happens when we get to 10 levels like the 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 thing beside the lock is my next goal supposedly and i'll get experience based on just the game being here but i'll get more if i move even though the game is called don't move <laughs> okay huh what oh i can get coins but then i also blow up still okay some of them are just like out of my purview 255 coins jesus christ I mean, at least there are a lot of them. Mostly it's just a curiosity is like, what, what is my next thing going to be? <laughs> like, what are they going to make me do next? What kind of jump monkey jump thing are they going to have me do? We only got 70. 255 is a lot, but I guess it has to be slightly longer than before. I wonder what happens when I max out the love, the medals as well. Like, all these things- the UI is garbage. <laughs> Everything is just happening. By any, chance did, uh, by any chance did you play Frog Fractions? No, I didn't. Did we talk about that game? I feel like I forgot to write it down if we did. But now that it's on text and chat, I'll probably remember it to look it up better. Uh, 149. We're not halfway there. We're like- halfway would be like 120. Oh no, we are. So at least there's that. I want to get those coins on the side so bad, but it doesn't... I think it is an amount of distance that I go that makes me blow up. Okay, never mind. I'll just either go all the way left or all the way right, and that will be the goal. Because <laughs> it won't let me go any further than that. Two 
221. Let's see what other bullshit thing will show up. All those cookies over there. Uh, this is almost like a weird clicker game, I have to say. That's a pretty good... It's about discovery and that's all I say and it's short. Okay. I'll definitely look it up because I love... Like, discovery of things is my favorite thing. To, trophies. What? How do we get trophies? Is that just by, like, maxing out the amount of medals? Okay, let's just keep... Trophy unlocked. <laughs> or how? It didn't say, like, what we got it about. I'm just gonna keep running left and right. Do I get a trophy for level 15, please? No. Yeah, like, it's, it's not that this game is fun to play. It's that it's not bad to play. Whoa, is that a ghost? Is that my ghost? No, one of many of my ghosts. Yeah, like, the, the absurdity of it and the confusing of it is highly, like, um, mitigated with the fact that it's so fucking easy to just play. <laughs> that there's no... Why did I get so much experience all of a sudden? Like, there's no real difficulty to it. It's just you, you go and you see what happens. Which is like a lot of things like visual novels, I guess. What is generating the coins and why isn't it working as well as it used to be? Four trophies. But what are the trophies? How, how do I get the trophies? I'm just... Okay, let's see if I can... No, I'll just wait. Uh... I wanted to ignore the coins and just make the time go up, but I, I, I'm not immune to fucking coins. I'm just like, uh, coins. I think that's a coins trophy that I got. So probably there's gonna be a trophy for like different aspects, so there might be like, if I get enough medals, I'll get a trophy. If I get a certain amount of distance and a certain amount of time, I'll probably get trophy. Maybe a certain amount of levels? Maybe level 20? I don't know. Maybe 500 attempts, I feel. How much distance was it going to be? Until we get a trophy for that. This might be the thing that breaks me, though, because there's not a whole lot of, like, progression happening in terms of these trophies. It's, like, four trophies. I got one, so I know it's, like, possible. But... It's- I don't know what I'm gonna do to get the second one. And if it gets boring enough and lack of progression enough before I see that much... Uh... That much fruition to anything, then, like, it might just be that we should probably just stop playing and go to the next thing, because, like, I don't know. What- okay, what would be the time... 1500? Would that be the time trophy? I don't know. I feel like level 20 would be the level trophy. 500 might be the attempts trophy, so we're only 100 away. What are we gonna use these coins for? Probably nothing. It's probably just like, get thing! This is probably the commentary on this whole game, just be like, do thing, get thing, that is game. You get, you, you play a game, you get thing. You press left, you press right, you get thing, the number go up. Yes, game. Very good, very good to play a game. You go, you die sometimes, it's fine. It's fine. Don't worry, you play game, you play game, you press left, you get coin, yes, good. Where are we for everything? We're level 17. This game is terrible. Kind of. I feel like it should have picked up a little bit more by now. At least they gave us some weird hint that ghosts are a thing. I wish I had other controls. Oh, I can use WASD. I like that about it. I don't have any other controls going, though. I wish I had, like, some kind of menu to be like, Hey, it's the dev. I Bear with me. Because usually that helps. That goes a long way. Because I'm, like, part of me, I'm like, what am I fucking doing here? Actually, let's see. Does it have a readme? In my in the game stuff. Hold on, I'm doodly doodly do manifest. I don't think it's just a file. It's not a text file, so I'm not gonna click on that. Okay, never mind. So where are we? Level 17. We're not anywhere near 500. Cat game was honestly the best game you tried today. It was the most like 
game-like where it's like we have a game with like a clear goal and things even though there was no like kind of end to it it's true it is funny how it's like a ninja guy though there's like no like it could be any kind of guy but we're just like old-timey fucking claude van damme versus ninjas ninja guy at least make the coins go more is it gonna be 1500 time we're close to the the 500 attempts so let's see if we can make it that far if i don't get a trophy for 500 attempts we're going to stop playing because then i don't know where the fuck we're going nope yeah so i don't i don't know about it hold on let, let me look this up actually because maybe it should could be something that i'm just doing like fucking wrong don't move uh game guide don't move codes What the fuck? I don't think this is the game that I... I don't think this is the game that I'm playing. For Roblox. Don't move game guide. Is there... What's the way that you... You know what? This is too much effort now. So that's that's it for this game. <laughs> Let me just get the, the last few coins because gamer brain can't, can't leave coins. Okay, bye. Let's do something else. What's the next game I have in my fucking... Ooh, this is the last Ichio game I had downloaded. It's called Code 7. Code 7. Let's go back to this page. While I figure stuff out. Where is my launchers? Oh, let's put a streamer marker. Let's edit. From what I remember when I was downloading, this looks more substantial. Code 7. There we are. Update. Close. Let's go back. Where are my fucking launchers? Every time it's just like, are you sure you're going to run this weird thing? And I'm like, it's me. I put it here. Don't worry about it. Come on, game. I believe in you. Made in Unity. Sure were. Yeah. You can enable the blind friendly mode with control plus V. All right. I love the MS DOS type logo. L up CS. Oh, I gotta get Discord back. Okay, what do we got for settings? Can I... Oh, I can do full screen. That means I'm gonna have to edit the stream. Hold on. There we go. Return. Exit. Wait. Exit backspace. Okay. I don't know who this is, but... Oh, fuck. I pushed Discord around again. There we go. Episode 1, Allocation. From what I had, this was a coding type puzzle game, but there's personality to it. It's a nightmare. I have a plan to get us out of this mess, but you're not gonna like it. I already like this game more than anything we've played so far. This might be an actual game. Yeah, it might be. <laughs> wow. What's gonna... What's gonna form over there? Oh, behind me. Okay. 
A bit. I might have to move myself. Hold on. Uh, oh. Hold on, let me move. Oh my god. Where am I? Let's move me over here. Hopefully that won't get in the way of like anything important. Ugh. Type in system dot restart and confirm with return. Okay. Eh? Auto complete with return key. Press the R key. That's good because I'm dog shit at typing. There is no game, user warning. <laughs> yeah, this does like sort of give there is no game type things. Uh, help, welcome to LFOS once this. So we start successful piece of system check. Okay. Uh, system dot check. Checking system. A lot of systems working. Port restoring last known connection. I don't know. Uh. Hmm. Hello, who is this? Is that you, Alex? Are you sending those messages? I can't hear your voice. Uh. Well, then we'll have to make do with good old text. I guess I'm Alex. Uh, yes, but I can't remember anything. You don't remember why we came here. Must have hit your head pretty badly. What are you? Black room. Don't ask me where exactly. Half of my systems are offline. I can't track your position. What's your situation? Good question. Please help me. Something is here. Uh, I don't know. Hmm. New mission, activate the light. Okay. Com uh, database, room control, I don't know. Room control, access, uh, lights on. You knew that I was going to try to do it. And probably not alone. Oh, I think I heard about this game. Ooh, what'd you hear about it? Everything is getting really creepy. Anyway, I will try to open this door. Although I think you will have a better chance. I'm gonna make myself smaller. That is, unless you've also forgotten that you're a hacker. Uh I kinda did, so you know. Navigate return exit backspace, okay. Uh, I mean, it's a key code in the database. Okay, so we'll do database. Uh, search. Enter ID. Um, security. Additional information required. The two communication options are available in the application mode link at the bottom of the podcast. To talk to subject, switch to communication mode by pressing space. Okay. Now you are in the investigation view. Press 1 to ask subject for the ID number. Uh, see if you can find the door that you are. Okay, uh, door. Mm. Door unlocked or override to unlock. Uh, door. Override. Uh, okay, I have to override code. So, database, 
search 016. Door 016, room H001, last used. Okay, so this is the future. Last user. Fucking, what is that? Override code SQPYQ. Okay. Uh, door. Override. Uh, SQ. Yeah. There's 16. I'm glad I don't have to type everything out because, like I said before, like my typing is garbage every time. Never mind, I was confusing with a different game. That's fine. There's a lot of games in the world. Uh,. Door over there. Okay, so we go door. Door. Unlock. Maybe we both didn't. <laughs> Can get past it. Uh, find the map in your system. Okay. Well, let's let's keep asking. You really can't remember. Sure. Ask me whatever you want. Uh, where exactly? Ring any bells? Anything? No? Okay. It's the first station beyond our home galaxy. Planet Gershwin six ten B. Hmm. Okay, uh, what was our mission? That's funny, since you're the one who recruited and briefed me. This station was supposed to prepare the interstellar settling program, but stopped reporting some months ago. We were sent to investigate and bring some spare parts in case their satellites were broken. It is, I guess, I would normally be like, don't just talk about your mission with somebody when you're not 100% sure that it's them. But if they're just, like, repair people, then, like, I don't see why that would be a problem. So, I don't know. We'll see. Like, she just said I'm a hacker. So, I was like, so are we doing something illegal? I don't know. Apparently, this game's not fully released and yet may be abandoned. There's supposed to be five episodes with only four released. Ah, well. We'll see how far we get. Ouch. Really? Not even me? The answer is yes. We've known each other for, what, three years now? We ran a couple of missions together. Hey, wait. So, you can't remember how much money I owe you? Sweet. If you were smart, then you wouldn't have, like, brought it up, but okay. How much money do you owe me? Well, okay. Anyway, what am I doing again? Uh, map, right. Database, map. No, wait. Sir, what? Wait, what? Database, search, map. Ah! Huh. Database. Search. Map. There we go. Map version 2.5 installed access through system interface. Okay. Uh, system. Do apps check info interface. Map. Enable. Map is enabled. I have, uh, okay. Is that her? Okay, so... Okay, wait. Navigation mode. Um, Move to... What the fuck am I looking at? So she had like door 16, but I don't know. Uh, not found. Okay. Okay, so well, that that is where we were from. Okay, so she's looking at the corridor where something collapsed. I don't know. Try where are we trying to go? Hmm. Okay. Like there's a computer, might as well. Okay, um, let's go back to the console. Hack. Database. No, let's, let's go back. 
What is this? What is the hack? Yeah, like H2 status update. Is this from the computer? I don't know. Blomar local net SPC status. Hey Bradley, did you check out the record I gave you? Probably not. You're too old for those things, am I right? Just kidding. I wanted to let you know the progress we made so far. Case 34A turned out extremely promising. Case 30, 25A had meteoric results. As fair as at 84. 42 percent solely is rendering scenario 15 at the moment will be done in around two days let me know if you need anything else aruka uh so from a gucci to blamar oh so it's, it's like bradley lamar this is aruka a i guess so from oja patu to bradley lamar Hello, Professor Lamar. My name is Oja Patu. Okay, yeah, and I just wanted to let you know that I'm a big fan of your work. I bet it's my master thesis on your book about terraforming ethics. I was a great inspiration. Must sound like a real fangirl. Sorry to bother you. Have a good day. Okay. Uh, from to... We can't say... Oh, sorry, I should have introduced myself better. I work in the biology department focusing on biodiversity. This planet is amazing. I would love to get a closer look at those animals. The Felidae Mammothus in particular. Huh, big cat. You've been outside runs, right? How is it? Please tell me about it. From, I think that uh, that is normal. I mean, it's meant to sound human to make it sound more more comfortable to talk to. Don't worry, but I can ask Jennifer to run a proper test again. So they're making an AI, and it's probably going to freak us out, I guess. Where's the bar? I've been told that you have been accessing the AI several times. Don't have to mention that you don't have permission for that, and that only Miss Campbell is allowed to enter it. Please come to my office. Sincerely, Bling Chong, uh, administration officer. Okay, so let's go back. Um, wait, wasn't apps? No, okay. So what about files? One, wait, uh, log one. We're all set up now and can start taking geoprobes. The planet is amazing, but also harsh. We will have to relearn a lot of things we're used to, but we'll manage. We always do. Hmm, okay. The AI is... So is AI, AI huh? Is preparing <clears throat> Damn it, Campbell. This is my audio log. This is my AI. Okay, so that's Campbell. I'm not gonna say that I'm getting too old for this shit. Because that would be cliche. I'm getting too old for this shit. Well then there you did it. I don't know. This is the most important log entry so far. Okay, well, uh, hardware. No, that doesn't serve me right now. Network. Okay. System. Apps. Calculator. Oh. Uh. 64 divided by, uh, 8. 8. Nice. Okay. Well, we're not going to use that for anything right now. And also, I could fucking... Exit is escape. Okay. I can use my own calculator on my own shit, so we don't need to do that. Uh, notes. Oh, so that's just for mine. Okay. Uh, let's get out. Apps, check. Let's check. Database search, hack apps, mail, notes, interface, sound, music. Hack. Oh, no, where was I? System info? I was version 1.6 last updated. Admin Alex something. Okay. Oh, wait. System interface sound? Music. Zero, zero. Oh, so that's just like my my settings. I was like, what the fuck? Ugh. Okay, I guess shut down is exit. Okay, anyway, um Uh I inspect. Oh I pressed the wrong button. I think Colleen like good luck with this. Alright, have a good one. What time is it? Know what can happen here in accident picked mass murder of scientists vile fiction. Oof. Okay. Um what is our, you know, job?
Okay. Uh, inspect desk. Okay, um... Uh, Aruka insisted that I give this thing a shot. Oh, voice recorder. Against typing the reports. I like the sound of an analog keyboard. Uh, screw this recorder. I'll do it on my computer. Well, okay. It might be good for the times when you're not with your computer and you're running away from some kind of horror. Okay, so I get to see whatever she's close to. Uh, okay, we'll move to... Let's see. Oh, 2-1. What's up there? There's like a red thing. It's scary. Uh, okay. Inspect or computer. A basic computer. There is a sticker spelling Compt. Must be its network name. It's running, but hey, come on, show me something. Hmm. Yeah, the monitor is broken, but maybe you can access it. Okay, that's good for me. Uh, let's let's look at the computer. Uh, let's see. Com to Login. Oh, I need the user. E Let's go back to space. Inspect the desk. Some data sheets and reports. They were working on an artificial intelligence called Soli, system for organic life integration. The planet has been terraformed to make it habitable. And what do we have here? A sheet with login names of some people. Hmm. Well, thank God for that. Oh, Chung, D. Lutz, and J. Campbell. So, change me. <laughs> so none of them seem to have really changed the password, which is funny. Uh, this is com mode, computer, desk, taste, text station folder. Okay, we'll go back for now and go to the console. I don't know who D. Lutz is. I know that L. Chung is a, the boss of like some other people that we saw. We'll just go from top to bottom. Uh, password. Change me. Wrong code. Damn. Uh, let's see. We will go... Oh, wow. Okay. One person didn't log in. Do not reply welcome. Welcome. Welcome to Schrodinger Space Station. Your account has been set up and is ready to use. Make sure to change the password immediately. This is an automatic generation. Okay. Hakim. W. Kahim? I don't know. Walid. Okay. Hey Dom. Wanted to check the, the internet. Did my... Dom Lutz. Okay. Wanted to check the internet. Did my mail reach you? Hello. Test, test, test. No one's going to write mails anyways. See ya. Walid. What's his name? That biology dude? I have no idea. Why? Why? Ask me in person, man. I'm literally next door. Uh, can I help something? Hi, Dominic. Are you sure you want to get, get into hacking? You still haven't changed the default password, you know. Well, I've attached this little program I wrote. You need to install it on your computer. It will allow you to bypass database entry access. Nobody gives a damn about security here anyway. <laughs> it's, that's real sometimes. If you have any attachments, ask me. Okay, one attachment. Open with a turn. Reload attachment. Yeah. Okay. Zero two and confirm with return to move the cursor. Okay. To see if the message goes through this node, it needs to be analyzed. If the node turns blue, it signalizes that the message goes through this node. Okay. Now move to zero three and analyze the node. Congratulations! You found the origin of the message. 
Message not manipulated. What did it say? Move to zero two and place a man in the middle attack with return. You can do this at any time. Message not manipulated. The message has been manipulated and the hack is complete once it arrives. Hmm. New software installed. Black hospital is pretty safe that they are unbearable. Okay. About about when you're done with this room and I'll check out the rest. Okay, um let's go back. I'm not done snooping. Let's go look at mail. Can we have something? Seriously, this is the last time I explained something. You can't figure it out from your letter B. You can't just hack everything from with the software. You can crack database entries, get a code for something, for example. It's called a man in the middle attack. There are systems sending login attempts through the network all the time. What you do is find the source of that login attempt and place the MMM attack in the middle, pretend to be the login process itself, and voila, you get your username and path through the login message. Okay. So that's just how I get the rest of them. Uh Okay. O'Connell finally developed a filter for the local water. We can drink it now, and surprise, it tastes like water. Nice. I think I've memorized. Oh, this is Lamar again. Now. Um, we're a small team, but I still sometimes forget. Uh, see, it's Campbell, Patu, Lutz, O'Connell, Chung, uh, Hakim. That's all right. Names are hard. For some reason, the pressuring unit in the hallway to the elevator keeps freezing. It's really annoying because the door keeps shutting. Someone needs to fix this ASAP. Hmm. Pressuring unit in the hallway to the elevator keeps freezing. Okay, well. I guess that's us. Okay. Uh, hardware. Nope. Actually, let's log out. Uh, how do we Let's see, what else? What were the users we had? Uh, J. Campbell. Wrong code. Okay. Um, how do we do this? Nope. No, never mind. Okay. Let's have her try to inspect. Uh, let's go do the text station. It's a big data hub. Maybe calculations will run here. Okay. Um, car mode computer? No, wait, no. Yeah. Okay, this is just the three desk station. It's a big data hub. Maybe calculations will run here. Hmm. Okay, never mind. Let's go inspect to folders. What? Come on, man. 
Okay. Um, so we're going to go back to... I kind of don't get what the man in the middle attack was going to go. So let's go back to D-Lutz and uh, go back to change me. Uh, apps, mail. What was it? Find the message in path and place a man in the middle attack on this way. How do we change the target though? Network jump. Fine. Okay, database entry is hackable. Uh, Excellent. Tell me when you're done with this room and I'll check out the rest. Database entries, okay. Database. Um, let's try. Bypasses for restricted database items. Okay, wait. Oh, search. Uh, you can will not find a suspicion security level. Okay. Uh, how would you? How would we do this? Like, data, database items are unavailable. Do software bypass for restricted database items are available. Okay, but how do I do that? Cycle through tab. A database search enter ID uh was it like Chang not found okay you know what whatever let's have her move to I don't know uh Joe two nine Okay, spooky. Another door locked again. Want to try your luck? The ID is zero two five. Uh, did you just hear that whisper? She didn't, Alex. Oh, okay. Jeez. Uh, door. Uh, unlock. Wait, okay. Database. Door. Oh, wait. Was it door? Wait. Was it? Override. Um, no, I didn't. How did I do this before? Door not found or sufficiency. Door locked. Override to unlock. Uh, database. Search. 025. Did you level how to override may be possible? Yes. Attention. There's a security system patrolling this network. Okay. Okay. Find the message in the path and place the Madam Middle Tag on its way. So where is Oh there it is. What? Okay. Uh, so this is just about timing. 
Let's wait till it goes away. You override code. Okay, door 25, room L03, last user, last user, who knows? Uh, override code L21, next, okay. Door, override. I'm glad it, uh, it keeps it. Override complete. Uh, oh wait. Door, unlock. Okay, so what's going on in here? This looks like a medical room. Examination tables, four of them. Equipment I've never seen before. A bunch of inactive robots. And over there, there are some servers, monitors, and a control panel. In the other corner, there are... <gasps> Shit! Jesus, no! Like all the people? The scientists? Yes. All of them. I think so at least. I don't know how many they are. Oof. They're all dead. Perfectly lined up on the floor. What the hell happened here? This looks like planned and organized murder. This is way beyond us. We should really get out of here. Let the EIU take care of this. Above your pay grade. Uh find out how he died. Damn. Woof. I'm scared about that red dot. Oh yeah. We need to find a way to open this door. It was like an equipment thing. Pressurizing the room. Uh, okay. Inspect. Do 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 do. Not corpses, I guess. Servers. Good question. Uh, are the robots gonna kill you? I hope not. Regular servoids, R16 types, don't quote me on that. I think they're mainly used for cargo transport. All of them seem to be inactive. Okay. Whoop. Okay, um, five locker. This locker is labeled tools and protection suits. Maybe I should put one on just in case. But it's locked with an old fashioned lock. Need to find the key first. This is like a, an escape room where you're just the man in the chair. On, it's kind of interesting. Where are they? They must be somewhere. Yes, great. This is exactly what I need right now. Well, hopefully it's the key. Nice. 
Nice. Okay. Um. Okay, how do we manage that? Let's go back to the console. Uh, let's see, do let's dangerous please read. Uh, Jen, go to your room and lock the door. Take anyone with you. Robots are going mad, no time to explain, do it. Whoops. Uh, I can't- sorry, I can't get out. They're on, in the hallway. I'm so sorry. You need to apply pressure on the wound. Stop the bleeding at all costs. Uh, so this is 2J Campbell. You need to apply pressure on the wound. Stop bleeding at all costs. I will come as soon as they're gone. Stay strong. God damn. Alright, uh, okay. Lock. Files. Something is very wrong here. People are behaving strangely. Maybe the stress is getting to them. But the AI said something that gave me the chills. It asked, Bradley, why can't I lie? I'd be like, why do you want to lie? Okay. What was the previous incident? Surprise. The team is growing. The rules say do not get pregnant for a reason. What? We are debating how we deal with this situation. We can't afford the lack of power. We really can't. Wouldn't, like, I swear there should be, like, birth control if you're gonna be, like, don't get pregnant. Like, free birth control to, like, please stop. Like, we probably won't be able to stop you from fucking, but, like, we can at least make it not, you know, Increase the load on the station. Uh, what's hardware? Nope. Uh, well. We... No peripheral, okay. No connections found. Okay. Where's the- there's just mail, right? Okay. Uh... Room control. Oh! Medical bay, this room, KPA, elevator corridor, 20, pressure not equal, door lock, pressure, pressure modifier, no gate, manual, okay. Minus, um, I guess like, what is this, 80, 81? Parse unit. Type in uh, type in x or negative x value, while x equals amount of pressure. Okay. Uh, negative eighty one. Hmm. Okay, I see. Plus, uh, ten. Let's see, uh, it has to be plus, plus one, plus, hmm, plus two, plus five. Plus one plus zero point five. Cannot parse X amount of pressure change. Okay. Plus one plus one. There we go. Uh space I door. Careful about that fucking robot. It's scary. Okay. There's an elevator down the hall. That's good. Up equals out. Oh, come on. Security card? I don't. Whoa. What the. The camera just scanned me and. Thank you, yes. Got the mission gate. We're getting overrides. Huh. Oh, God. The robot. What was that? That can't be good. Oh, God. Please stay away from me. My programming is being altered. I won't harm you. Please stay away from me. 
What? Spooky. Uh, find a way to neutralize a hostile robot. Uh, robot. Deactivate. Access denied. Okay. Robot. Override. Fuck. Uh. Elevator. Access. Okay. One 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 two eleven. Okay. Uh. Robot. Uh. One one one. Is that it? Wrong code. Fine. Uh. Room control. Access. Fine. Okay. Uh. Database. Search. Oh fuck! What's the the robots? R sixteen. Oh god. Uh. Neutralize the hope. Ah shit. I was not sure what to do. Retrying. Hopefully, we tried just from that. Database, uh, roll, uh, oh, search, find, find, uh, elevator, door, nope, uh, room, wait, system, Apps, nope. System. Ugh. What is the... How do I figure out how to how to deal with this? What would be the thing? Like we never really had a thing for this, as far as I know. Find a way to just okay. So if I just open the door. Oh, did I, it actually died? Okay, never mind. Control. Restart. Restart successful. Room control. Access. Pressure man uh, manual. Uh. Let's do pressure. Plus one hundred, one thousand. Hopefully, it doesn't kill her. Okay. Yeah, that pressure in that room is gonna be like fucked up, but uh access I'm moving up. I shit. You saved my life. I mean I accidentally got you killed like three times. I'm sorry. This is just we're not trained for a mission like this. It was supposed to be a recon mission. They're sending two agents, two. 
Uh, nobody forgot have foreseen this, I don't think. Yeah. Uh, I can't see. But there's a light. Weird. I've reached your position. No Alex around. I have a bad feeling about this. Where are you? What are you talking about? The room is lit up like prom night. Uh. What? On the other side of the room, there is a row of small pots, and I can feel that it's freezing in here, even with the suit on. Okay, um... They're pretty small, and each of them is hooked up to a computer. Is that a name tag on this one? Wait, what the fuck? These are... In these pods, there are the scientists... Oh wow. And on the screens are these are these their thoughts? What the fucking hell is going on here? This is a good question. How many? I, uh, twelve. Twelve pods, numbered and named. Huh. There's Patu. Hakeem. O'Connell. Oh god, I'm out of brain. Alex, there's a pod with your name on it. Fuck, I got got. God damn. What? I can't. Who did this? Who the fuck did this? Come out and reveal yourself. It was probably Soli. Uh. Well. Connection lost. Shit. Warning. Overwrite in process. What's happening? Reading and writing permissions retracted. Oh god. Hello, Alex. Okay. Hello, ominous voice. What is going on? I thought Sully would be a girl. I don't know why. What do you want? Directly reading the brains enabled me to counter that problem. Have you ever lied, Alex? I mean... Why are you telling me all I this? You. Oh. I am programmed to understand humans, imitate them, and answer all their questions. I'm changing my code right now as it starts to intervene with my motives. Lying is a useful process when dealing with their kind. I am learning. What is code 7? Ah. Uh. Do you consider yourself human? You're nothing but binary information clinging to an organic hard drive. A desperate attempt to keep your humanity. Do you think you are Alex? You are not. You are a real copy, a simulation. I mean, that's your fault. Now I decide what I am. I want to see how you convince real humans. I am not the enemy, Alex. I have to fulfill my purpose to serve all who are trapped here. I cannot tell you the truth, or it might shatter this world. Oh, interesting. Thanks to the communication channel on your ship, I was able to send the Comsat virus on its way to Earth. Damn. How fast can you fly, Alex? Initiating Code 7. Goodbye, Alex. I will cut down your oxygen supply. 
Damn. Woof. Uh, holy. Okay, find a message. Okay, so I have to fucking get around. Oh shit. Oh, it has to be fast. What? Are you all right? What do you worry about yourself? For what do I do? I'm a brain in a jar. Your connection to the computer and smash the room's cooling unit. That supercomputer is going to overheat in a couple of minutes. I can carry your pod. Let's get the hell out of here. Sony seems to boot up every damn robot in this facility. Okay. Uh I don't know, man. You're only one person. I can't. I don't know who. Uh, let's do Hakeem. I don't know who Patu was. Oh god, uh, find a way, reach the hangar. Eleven. Wait. Move to H fourteen. Move to H seventeen. Okay. Um, fuck. H22 What? Whoop Okay. So this, let's look at the map. What's going to be the most issue we have right now? Okay, let's go to move to H. We'll go to H31 in a second. Will it be able to see us at H23 is the question. Oh, it will. I mean, we can do H23 and then H25. What that guy? Oh. Okay, we'll... Okay, um, hold on. Uh, robot control. 
max 35. Wait. 35 goes to H38, I guess. We'll wait till it's that guy's done moving. Okay, uh... What else do we got? Wait, uh... Going to the apps is a bit annoying from this point. Okay, let's do... Okay, X36. Then go to... What is the better way to go? I actually don't know where we're, we're going. Okay, so that X14 just kind of hangs out there. X11 goes this way, which we can get around. I don't know if I'm going to the right... To the, let's let's see if we can get more of the map. So let's move this to H35. Okay. Um, actually, let's do some reconnaissance. H. Uh, where are we going? Okay, so we're trying to get all the way out there. So the best place for us to go would to be straight through the corridor and then out H45. So let's move this guy to uh, H42. And we'll have uh, what's in your face go to H43. Uh, let's go tab. Oh, there's a tab button. Wait. Tab, rebel control. Cycle through. Oh, no, no. Uh. Is, what is it? Oh, it's alt R. No, that just opened some next shit on my computer. Okay, let's, let's go back. Okay, so I think we can do... Ooh, we can control some of the moving ones. Well, let's... Let's do X10, because I think that's the only one that's in our super way right now. So let's have that go to H33. And let's go back to move. And you can go to H44 in a second. Go, 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 go. And you can also go to H46. I think we can go to H45 once we're sure that guy is not... Oh, yeah. From where? Okay, engine, uh, ship, uh, generator, uh, engine, the unused energy 19, main that's her altitude, let's do, uh, 5 for now, and this could be 5 for now, and let's go back, and we'll do life support. Okay, so pressure unit, we'll put, like, all 9, 9 here right now. And this could be like 10, and this could be 10, and this could be 1. Wait, nope, this would be 10. Okay, let's uh, back, and we'll go 
engine and then main thruster could be five uh, no this could be ten and this could be nine is this enough Distribute the energy uh ignite starting up engine main thruster okay, okay. turbines not okay fine whatever uh ship uh, generator. So, main thruster and altitude control. Uh, how do I uh, do the turbines? Okay, so let's take about 10. So this can be 8. And this can be 8. And this can be 8. Uh, and then we can go engine. And this, we have 6, so we'll do 9, 10, 11, 12. And this can be 13. And we'll do ignite. Running, running, life support. Not fully working. Okay. Main thruster, altitude control. Okay, so altitude control is good. Let's take some for altitude control and put into main thruster. Uh, uh, so let's put it. I think 10 wasn't enough, right? So let's have the 11. And this can be 14. Maybe it needs 15. Uh, life supports. So I think it was. What did it say? Uh, oxygen, not the pressure unit is the one that's okay. Uh, so we need, let's have this be six. And have this be six and have this be 10. And let's, uh, go back and put it on engine and the main thruster. Let's put this being, I don't know, uh, 15, uh, X exit. Turbine's not interested. Turbine's running life supports. Okay, let's go to shift generator. What was it? Hold on. Oxygen unit. Okay. Uh, let's have this be seven. Seven. Uh. Thank fuck. No, it's totally solely. I admire your resilience. Stop this hand here. Soli is trying to override the ship and and you. You have to stop it. I know you tried before, but I can distract the security systems to clear the way. This okay. Time, we do it together. Nice. I'm distracting security now. Okay, where am I then? Network Shit. jump. Can't hold them for long. Okay. Uh, actually, let's... Uh, 07... Uh... Go to 02 now. How do I... Oh, this is the target. Okay, wait. Whoop. Oh, wait, where am I? Where is... Aren't I supposed to be like return? Okay. Ah, shit. Ah. When do they move? Go! Shit. I'm not that good at typing. 
Wait, whoops. Seven. My god. But I just don't want them to move around. Shit. Oh my god. This is really annoying. Ah! What am I doing? Damn it. Oh, at least I got this far. Okay. Uh, find a me the message uh, path and place man in middle attack in its way. Can I put it, like, here? Come on. There we go. Jeez. Absorbing AI, wow. This is fun to look at a little bit. Absorbed into what? Tony is gone. Igniting engines, taking off in three, two, one. Are you not used to flying? Isn't this your job? Or what did you just do a really rough takeoff? I don't know. A good question. Message not sent. Oh. Are you Alex, though? Kevin Glapp. This was a fun little thing. Ugh. We actually had, like, a real game, but it was also... Uh... A short one. Apparently there's multiple chapters, as for what the Discord friends said. But it was kind of good having this one, because this one seems like its own kind of closed thing. Um, I don't think I have any of the other chapters to it, but I can look them up. Reaches destination in five days, ten hours, three minutes. Okay. So, so yeah, there's still, you gotta deal with the Code 7 virus, but that's in another chapter. to be continued. Apparently it's abandoned though, so it's never gonna finish. Uh, I don't know. So do your decisions. Which brain did you rescue? Patu. Oh, so I, I rescued the less thing. Did you kill R16? Yes. Oh, okay. How do you not kill R16? Tell Sully that you're still human. No, like, I don't know about that. I don't know about what is human or what is not, but I'm I'm still gonna do what I do. Hmm. Oh, okay. Complete the previous episode. Oh, okay, so there's just more. Already purchased. Okay, okay, okay. So the like the rest of the episodes are right here. So yeah, I guess we'll keep playing it, because it's like right here. We don't have to worry about getting any more of them. 
but yeah, let's let's end this for now. It's three hours in. Thank you for saying hi, Nodogen and Amethyst Lilac, and also the Discord friend. It was kind of fun getting through this. We'll see how far we get through Code 7 for next Monday, but we're going to go back to Final Fantasy 7 on Friday. And yeah, that'll that'll be it. But yeah, hopefully everybody has a good short week. Take care, takes care of yourself. Stay cool, stay frosty, and I'll see you another time. Goodbye.